Good evening and welcome back everyone. Just wanted to say off the bat, really appreciate you guys' support. Any sort of likes to get, comments, just the views, if you know, watching the video and all that sort of stuff. It really does help the channel. I really do appreciate it. Going into today, which is the last match before the transfer window closes, we're away to Espanyol. And a few changes. We are going to give the likes of Martinelli and Messi a rest. Diaby and Mudrik coming in on the wings and Diaby will take that captaincy armband. Castro on and up playing in the centre forward role. Got Bellingham, Pedri and Vieira starting again in midfield. Got a back four of Kostanug and Gavardiol with Azpilicueta and Baca on the wing back positions. And Schubert in goal. Lovely looking stadium at Espanyol today. And the next match after this is a crunch tie against Barcelona. And then we've got Atletico Madrid as well. So two massive matches coming up. They're currently in third and fourth spot. Real Madrid in second. Or nine points clear of them. Like I say, nearing the end of the transfer window. is about five or six days. But uh, no matches after this between then and that uh, 31st of January. I'm hoping we'll get some bid in for our players, players that we want to loan out and potentially one or two that we, we may want to sell. Um, but nothing so far, it's been strangely quiet. That's not a free kick, he got the ball. Yeah, ideally we want to loan maybe a couple of players out. Maybe one or two sales. You know, certain players, obviously, uh, the likes of Balboin, I know we've been playing him a little bit recently, but um, I do think he's not going to be one for the future for us, unfortunately. Anyway, here's Mudrick. Now Pedri. Mudrick again. Oh, hits the post. Whoa, what a clearance that is from the defender. It looked like it was going to be an own goal for a second. What a brilliant clearance. Baquet, really nice ball to him. Oof, nearly catching the keeper out. Yeah, on corner duty. Oh, Diaby, maybe should have gotten the end of that. Ah, oh, referee. Uh, it's going to be one of them games from the referee, isn't it? Anyway, let's see what we can do. Good tackle from Guardiola. Nice bell out wide to Mudrick. Not quite into his path of running there. So he had to hold up a little bit. Back again though. Now Pedri. To Vieira who's been excellent lately. And what happened there? He manages to keep it though. Now Pedri. Back it. Nearly. Nearly got fouled. Nearly got in. Well, 15 minutes in. <laughs> we haven't got a goal yet. Um, it's all been happening. Pedri does well to keep that. And as Pelaqueta, fairly recent signing. He has Castro. Oh my word, what a finish that is from Castro. Great word from Pedri, he was getting his shirt pulled. As Pelaqueta into Diaby, nice touch, but look at that finish, top left corner. On the half volley. Yeah, lifts the ball up here. Difficult finish. Whew. Great opening goal. Yeah, again, scoring inside that 20 minute mark. Which we've been doing well, the last few matches at least. Here's Mudrick. You can see back on the overlap. Really good play there. Pedrin, oh, Diaby, what are you doing offside there? You didn't need to be... Oh, he's really far forward there. Didn't need it. Good 
Good play there. And Bellingham with a decent tackle. Pedri. That's a good tackle there. Do you know be giving the ball away? Oh, referee. Every 50-50 challenge isn't going against me. Chance for a counter, though. Now Bellingham. Maybe he hasn't been having the best games lately. Really nice play. Somehow they keep a strong hand there, but there was lots of, I, I wouldn't even call it one, two. It was just backwards and forwards between Castro and uh, Pedri. Great stuff there. Now, can we get on this course from this corner? I'm not sure what that header was from Pedri or shoulder or whatever it came off. There was a chance, though. It was a good corner. Nearly pressure them into making a mistake. And we do in the end. And Kostanu still forward. Now Pedri. Ah, straight the keeper. Decent strike, but not enough power on it. Palaqueta into Castro. And Mudrick with space. Oh, hits the post again. We haven't had the luck today. I haven't had the luck. Oh, that's not a good ball from Bellingham. A dangerous place to give it away. Luckily, the opposition have gone backwards a little bit. Good work from Vieira. Not a great pass, though. Again, just a little bit sloppy there. You know, doing the hard work and then making a little mistakes. Costner getting pushed over, but don't get anything for that. Of course. Oh, come on. I just said nothing is going for us, and that just shows exactly what I mean. Good save. Go to clear the ball. The ball hits the keeper's leg and falls straight to the opposition. You do get those games where you kind of feel like it's going to go against you. I suppose that's, that's kind of real life as well. Oh, really nice ball there. Good save again. We should have scored. It's just not quite fallen for us. The fouls aren't going away either. It's just those little things. And it's half time 1 1 somehow. I've got no idea how it's finished 1 uh, 1 at half time. I mean, I've got to say, Espanol are very, very lucky not to be 3 or 4 0 down. And then to get that goal was quite frankly ridiculous. Um, anyway, second half. Nice play by Pedri. Now back at good ball in. How do how has Diaby not scored there? How? I actually, I genuinely thought it was in. It was a fantastic ball from back. I drilled across. I don't know how he's missed. Got to be scoring that. Really do. Anyway, here's Vieira. Oh, nice ball hitting it, Madrid, but somehow defender gets back. Keep the pressure on, though. Did well. Here's Pedri. What can he do? There's no one in support. 
He gets it back now. Again, I don't know how to defend it. Suddenly he had a burst of peace. Now Pedri. Back again. Somehow deflects. Diaby. 2-1. Oh, God, this is a tough game. We're just almost forcing that ball to go in. Pedri gets a bit unlucky there. Diaby wins it back and then slots it away. Great finish. Let's keep going. We need to get that third goal, get a bit of space. Some games like this, you've just got to get in, get the three points and get out and just accept that some games the luck's going to go against you. Here's Giovi, Ruben Castro. Well, of all the tackles in the game, I didn't really think that was a foul. We'll get it. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. Strange, isn't it? He's back at. Now, Pedri. And there it is. 3 1. He's deserved that. He's played well today and just hasn't been a little bit unfortunate. Back will get the assist as well. Nice little touch, but it's the finish that does it. Pass the keeper. A little bit of breathing space. Just a little bit. And we'll make some subs in a second as well. And we're going to bring on Joaquin on the left for Mudrick. We're going to take off Vieira and Pedri, bring on Lee Kangin and Modric. You know, the, the guys going off, Mudrick, Vieira, they've done the job. It's been a tough game. Get some fresh, fresh bodies on the pitch. Hopefully don't let in any more calls. Good tackle and again we don't get the luck. Get the tackle in and it just somehow falls to their defender. Uh, their player rather, not defender. Oh nice play from Wasbro Quetta there. Nice ball. Now Lee Kang in. Joaquin down the line. He's very quick. Ah, oh, that was poor though. Nice play from Modric. Just keeping the ball. And a burst of speed forward. Oh, it's just behind Castro. Castro. And he gets a goal. Maybe a tiny bit of luck this time. It's nice play from Modric. And this ball gets deflected. So, unfortunately, won't be classed as an assist. Really nice finish from Castro. Reacted well. I mean, I say a bit of luck. The ball was going to him anyway. Um, but the deflection could have diverted it anywhere. 4-1. That's more reflective of the game. Good tackle from Bellingham there. Nice ball to Kang and Lee. Oh, my God. Yeah, we've hit the post, is it three times today? I think it's three times. And again, we get two players tackling a player there and somehow we don't get the ball. That's a shocking ball. I tried something different there and it didn't work. I'm not going to do that again. Tried the lofter pass, but holding up as well to sort of make it a bit more of a drilled pass. Didn't work. Right, Lee Kang in now. Now Modric. It's not a great tackle. They get away with that. And here's Modric again. Oh, Castro not quite. Just turn into the path of the uh, player. 
Bellingham. Now Modric. Oh, no, no, just over and wide. Should be hitting the target. Actually had room to run on a little bit. Got a tackle and base forward from Bakke. And still Bakke. Oh, went for the blockbuster. Just overhit it. He does score those now and again. He scored one, ooh, when was it? I can't remember when it was, but it was in this season a few games ago. Maybe in December at some point, was it? He scored one of those. He pretty much ran the full length of the pitch. Scored from like 25 yards. Oh, Joaquin in now. Oh, ball just beyond Diaby. Now Modric. To Lee Kang in. Now Modric. Oh, what a save. I thought Modric has got his goal. How will you save that? I don't know. Was that Cousins? I believe that was Cousins. Right, let's... Let Oh, do we want Modric to take it? Yeah, let's let Modric take it. Stuff it. Oh, straight at the uh, opposition. Straight at the wall. Not much space here. Modric! Oh. <laughs> Some strange goings on today, there really is. I mean, that could have gone in. Is it? That would have been very unfortunate for them. And then they've cleared it off the line. That's a poor throw. That's a foul. I was trying to take it quickly, but it didn't let me. Modric into Azpilicueta. Surely that's a foul. Just let it go out. Oh wait, let me take it. Come on. He's a bit slow there. Nice play. Diaby into Modric. Now Castro into Modric. Oh. And that'll be full time. 4 1. Strange game, but we've got the three points in the end. Castro getting man a match with Diaby and Pedri of a similar rating. Wouldn't disagree with that. I'm not quite sure why Azpilicueta got a 4.5. I didn't think he really did anything wrong as such. Backer getting a 7. Subs coming on. Joaquin, I thought he was better than a 5. He showed, okay, maybe give the ball away once or twice, but he was always willing to run and some decent passes. And Modric looked very good coming on. But that's it for today, guys. Again, really do appreciate your support. Next match is a big crunch tie at home to Barcelona. Then we've got Atletico Madrid. And also in the next video, we'll see an update to see if there's been any incomings or outgoings in the transfer window before that closes. So I'll keep you updated in the next video. If you can hit that like button, drop a comment down below to let me know what you think of the series. And subscribe to the channel to keep up to date. And I'll see you next time. Cheers.